Howdy y'all, welcome back to Ouncecraft. Uh, oh, Jesus, didn't want to do that. Uh, I am doing a little terraforming here. Um, made this little bit cleaner area, water down here so I could plant, I guess you call it plant, plant my uh, oysters. And then you take a piece of sand and you click it in there and those will turn into pearls eventually. I think it has something to do with the deeper the water or something like that, the more water there is around them, the, the faster it grows or something like that. I don't know, but that's what you do. This over here planted a, uh, another tree. I, I needed a magical biome. This is a, where is it? Magical forest, yep. It's magical forest over there, but it actually extends up and around and cuts into this little piece right here, which is bordering on my base right there. So I chopped down a few trees. Apparently I missed one. Where's my axe? Get. Go and get. There we go. Thank you. So yeah, so I needed the magical place because I want to plant some uh, mana beans. Eventually get a mana bean uh, farm going. But as for right now, I went and snagged myself a couple villagers with my safari nets. And I got them stuck in here in this fabulous spruce planked uh, room. <laughs> More like jail cell, but all the zombies are going to love them. But they can't get to them, so I ain't too worried. But yeah, so what my plan was here, so I cleaned it up a little bit here. See, I got some nice little straight lines, nice straight edge here. I want to make this, ooh, that was kind of cool. Make this one, like, large structure where you can go in. Yeah, I planted this Quicksilver tree here, too. Oh, Quicksilver, it's not called a Quicksilver. Silverwood makes Quicksilver. I planted this here to try to get this part to uh, expand a little bit further out. The magical forest part of it. Anyway, so yeah, so I was going to put, basically, I guess, up, up to the edges here. And on the inside, I want to make, like, like rooms with doors, so possibly, like, an in indoor, possibly, maybe get some spawns of villagers in there, kind of thing, get them to reproduce, kind of thing, maybe, instead of building, like, the room upon room upon room upon room, like, stacks that they do. Uh, honestly, I, I could just go to villages randomly and just snag them with a safari net, but I want the structure to be indoors. See if I can get some trades or whatever. I'm not really looking at the trades right now. So, yeah. So, that's my next step. Uh, I also made myself a new wand. Did a whole bunch of research, made myself a new wand. Got a copper capped great wood wand right now. And it is. Armed and ready. I uh, got some focuses. Some foci. Blink. Take that bitch. Alright. Put that away. Yeah, so I got a whole bunch of wood. Whole bunch of wood. Do some do some building. I'm gonna start with a foundation of great wood. Cause it's nice and dark. Really, really dark. So let's see, let's put it right up against this edge. Oops. That's weird, the planks go the other way. With the great wood. Huh. That's interesting. Anybody ever notice that? Planks go the other way with this, with this stuff? Alright, well, let's go ahead and make our foundation. Yes, I know I missed one. Where are we here? Let's go with this big. I also did a... I'm not sure where I want the front door. I'll just leave that there for the front door. I gotta be careful with this axe, because, uh... It will, uh... Take down a whole freaking wall. Okay, I think I went one too far. Nope, nope, we're good. Come on. 
There we go. Drunk driver. Oh. <laughs> that was funny. Why did I do that? That was really weird. There we go. Okay, where's that spot? Next is Roos. One more spruce. I need more spruce. Lenny spruce? Yeah, you just keep keep busy there. Keep your eye on them villagers. I wish I had some birch, but a whole bunch of birch stairs. I don't feel like going and finding some birch right now. I guess I could put some in the planter, the harvester or whatever. So yeah, that's pretty weird. The great wood goes the other way. I kind of want it to look like it's like faded. Like fading. Going from dark to light kind of thing. That's why if I had the spruce, not the spruce, the uh, birch, it'd be like the lightest part. Kind of like how I did the the uh, first one, that the building and the spawn. But I got a lot of spruce. I got a lot of oak. Don't have a lot of. Uh, don't have any birch. <laughs> I don't think. I don't think I've cut down a single birch tree. Probably do double doors. I think I need to put a trench on the other side of this so it's not butt up against the the uh, ground there. So yeah, so I've been a little busy. Um, yeah, pretty exciting. Last time, that freaking nether dragon. I've never seen that before. Of course, everybody's going, oh dude, that's been there for like years, whatever, but <laughs> I've never seen it. Unless it's something new, specific to this mod, or some mod, or something, I don't know. I'm out of spruce. 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 I'm out of spruce already. Awesome. Righty there. Oh, yeah. It's funny. Uh, I, uh, when I was digging underneath this thing, listen. You hear it? That's just a ton of mobs underground. Cause there's still there's still a uh, cursed earth under there, and it's still spawning mobs. Look at look at look at look at look at them spread, dude. Look how awesome that is. Black roses everywhere. So I stuck some down there. Look at them spreading all over down there. How awesome is that? It's spreading all over here, and I stuck some over here too. Get some maybe on the side. They haven't spread yet. Seems to take a little bit of time. I let the server run for quite a while. Just sitting there running. Oh, yeah, and get this crap. Soul sand? Give me a ghast here. Stupid. I could have been just siphoning freaking soul sand and just got my ghast tears. But, because I got enough ghast tears, and I got enough of these... I don't need them anymore. I don't need to go to the nether to hunt them anymore. Nor do I need to go to the nether to find Ardite. So take that nether. Yeah, take that. Oh, those aren't ready yet. There's a few more going on that one. Grab these while I'm up here. So yeah, I did a bunch of research on the th Thumb craft. Did a bunch of stuff on that. Um, enough, obviously, to get me a new wand, new caps. Uh, what else did I get on that? I did a whole bunch of random stuff. I got all the focus except for the last one, which I can't remember what it was. What was it? I don't have my book on me. Dun, 
twat. Twat was it. Uh, what did I do in my book? Did I drop it off in... Yeah, it's in the house, isn't it? Erg. Yeah, so I got a whole bunch of research notes that I need to do. Um, oh, there's some more great wood planks. Yeah, so, yeah. So I got all the foci. I got all of these. Except for this one, the portable hole. Which is probably kind of tough. I can imagine, since it's off, like, to itself on the side. I uh, did some things over here. Ooh, what's that one? Totemic one core. Hmm. I got this. Uh, this is apparently, like... I can just set things on fire in the nether in case they destroy my under portal, my uh, nether portal. Uh, obviously the rose. Um, took care of this and this. I haven't bothered with that yet. I haven't done that one yet. Golemancy, I haven't done anything with that. Uh, that was free. I haven't started these yet. Probably will though soon. Uh, I haven't done anything with these yet either. What's that? Efrit's Flame. Ribbons won't make a difference. Interesting. So that's another focus, huh? I'm guessing it's probably fire. That makes sense. Yeah, so. Did a bunch of stuff there. Uh, yeah, so I got a ton. Reach search notes. Did I already? I'm pretty sure I already did that one. Excavation, frost, shock. Yeah, I have. I have this other one that's the other one that's in here. It's still got a focus on it. I don't know how to get the focuses off of them unless you just make more than one. Which would be kind of annoying, but you gotta make more every time you get a new wand. Okay, what did I need? I need not that, not that. Jesus, spruce. Nope, there. I'm doing this the hard way. Boom. That should be enough. Uh, I made myself a vanilla crafting table because I'm going to have to start doing... not going to have to start doing, but I'm going to do the uh, unstable ingots. It has to be done in a vanilla crafting table. Unfortunately. How are you guys doing? Still just chilling out? Good. You guys just... Hang out, keep talking. Alright, so we'll do the next layer spruce. Do do do. What did I just pick up? A freaking mushroom. Oh, 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 that was going good. It's going good for a second there. Oh. Oh. I'm drowning. Please don't destroy the whole wall. Thank you. <laughs> Please don't destroy the whole wall. Thank you. That happened to me on that one. I just wanted to, like, knock out one. And, ha, you see? They're trying the door. That's funny. And it knocked on the whole freaking half of the building. <laughs> like, the whole side. <laughs> All right, uh, get rid of you. Where's my, where's my great wood? Well, that's some great wood. Let's see if I had the spruce, the, the, uh, spruce, I keep calling it spruce. If I had the birch, I'd have one more layer, but I don't think I need one more layer. I think this looks good enough. This great wood is really chocolatey. And it's really weird that the, it goes the other way. The planks go the other way. 
I did a whole lot of flying. Oh, why do you keep doing that? Did a whole lot of flying around looking for uh, nodes. Found a bunch of nodes. Only managed to find one Perdido. That's really weird. I flew all over the freaking place. And uh, there was like two like right under my base. I didn't even notice after flying all over the place. Alright. Uh, guess we don't really need a roof as of right now. Let's go ahead and put some light on this situation. Or we could just put it randomly right there for some reason. Don't know why. Come on. Break. Wow, really strong. You're just freaking glowstone. <laughs> Break. Damn it. Some on the corners. And then I'm going to dig a trench on the side of that. So I've got dudes trying to climb up on my roof or over the roof. Where's my shovel? Oh, yeah, here, let me show you while I'm down here. I made a path. And another set of stairs leading down. See? So you can come down my original stairs. You can go that way to the mine. Or you can go this way down here. And uh, this was an opening to a cave that's like right there. So I just kind of covered it with cobblestone. But I want to make like a path out of this. You know, something, something interesting. Some kind of stone, probably. Maybe just regular stone. I don't know. Something leading down here. And then a little step. And into here and that, so I'll have a path coming down into here and then I want to build like oh, I want the, like the mana bean farm maybe be like up against this wall just like a whole bunch of wood with mana beans on it uh, eventually use like golems golems whatever they are to uh, automate it and then uh, make like a dock or something coming off of here put like a fisher like an automatic fisher or something out here put some boats in I kind of wish I had like a stone. Yeah, I think I want a stone foundation for this. Alright, let's get this thing dug out. Go, go, diamond shovel. But obviously, I'm going to have to have more than just two dudes in here. I guess I could put them in the auto spawner and turn off the grinder and just spawn a whole shit ton of villagers in my base. That might lag the hell out of the place though. I love that he keeps trying the door. He wants to leave so bad. Sure. Sure. Hey guys. What you doing? Yeah? Really? Maybe I'll give him a roof. Here, have a roof. I hate it when it does that. I hate it when it does that. I hate it when I do that, too. Oh, whatever. Here, break it. Break it with the pickaxe. I don't trust my axe. I use the pickaxe instead of the axe. There you go, guys. All right, so we got the general structure built. Uh, let me figure out, do some a little planning and things and whatnots. And can I center a two-set door here? Yeah, I can. Can I? Cool, I can. So I can do that. Ah, that's what I didn't want it to do. All right, all right. I'm gonna have to fix that. <laughs> I'll be back. All right, y'all, so for some reason, one of my villagers despawned. Don't know why, but they did. So I only had one villager. Uh, I went back, grabbed another one, and decided, you know what, instead of just emptying this village, which I did anyways, empty the village, <laughs> there was only two left. So I grabbed two more. But uh, I came back, I stuck one in the auto spawner, and so I spawned a whole bunch. So now I got like 20 villagers in the auto spawner. 
Uh, obviously, I turned the mob grinder off, and uh, so they're just kind of sitting in there. I poked a few holes in it so it wasn't completely dark in there. And hopefully, I won't get any like other random spawns in there. Look at them all. There's quite a few in there. Oh, that's a neat hat. I don't think I've ever seen that one before. Yeah, a lot of bald heads in there. So yeah, I don't know why it despawned, but it did. Uh, I was a little upset about that. In fact, I think they both despawned now. Oh, nope, he's still in there. That guy's still in there. I do have another one here, so... Here, have a buddy. Oh, you got a hat now. <laughs> you guys have fun. Chat. Get to know each other. All that fun stuff. Alright, so yeah, so I fixed the fixed the front, uh, put a roof on things on the front door. And this is what I'm doing in here. So I got that part laid. Uh just working on this part now laying down the uh, great wood the great wood can't be chiseled unfortunately because it'd be nice if I could have a matching pattern but I think it's kind of cool because the uh, stripes on the great wood go the opposite direction so it's a nice little contrast I think yeah I think it looks kind of neat but yeah so uh, we're gonna get this floor put in and uh, hopefully my shovel will last. I won't need to make another one. And then uh, we'll start building some uh, interior. So uh, I'll be back when I'm done with the floor. All right, so I jumped ahead a little bit here. Uh, used uh, some micro box to make, I guess, walls. I guess you'd call it uh, some arches. Um, I'm not sure if I want them to be able to just kind of free roam through here or not, but I kind of want them to like be able to mingle. I don't know. Maybe not. Maybe I'll close it off. But working on the roof here. Uh, yeah, so I use these things. Where are they? These oak wood planks slabs, which are micro blocks. Oh, oh, lag. Oh boy. Oh yeah, and if you haven't noticed, I made myself an actual axe, and not that crazy ass force axe. That uh, thing is a little slightly unpredictable. So I think we're just gonna top this off. I think I might make one all the way around. Eh, maybe not. I don't know. Let's see how this goes. I'm gonna put a put some light down here. Blink. Alright, so it's kind of half going. Kind of halfway there. I think on this side, uh, I'm going to do something a little different. Maybe just do like some like counters or something. And not so much this kind of thing. Maybe yeah, do something like this. Yeah. Yeah, let's do that. It's gonna be off by one. <laughs> it sucks. You know, it doesn't really bother me though, for some reason. For some reason it doesn't bother me. I think it's actually kind of a neat little thing. Now I wonder if you can jump through there. My guess is no. Yes. Good. Okay. So they can't jump that. Excellent. Let's see now. I wish I had used some different colored wood. Well, you know what? Let's do this. Can I micro block great wood? 
Why does it sound like they're getting hurt out there? No, not that way. This way, yeah. And then... Strips. Bam. Put a couple accents. Yeah, see? This ain't so bad. That's kind of neat. It's here for microblocks. Where can I stick one of these? Up that way. Mm. Kind of floating. <laughs> Oh, Jesus. Nice. Hi, Mr. Spider. Christ. That was a hell of a jump. Guess we're going to do something about that. Alright, uh, what was I doing? <laughs> Wonder... If I could put one, oh yeah, let's just do this. I wonder if I could fit like a, a little like block in there. Nope. There we go. No. <laughs> Derp. No! Switch is right at the last second. Thank you. That's kind of cool. I don't know, I like that. We can go back and add some more accents in other places. Now, cause what I was thinking was I had all these doors on me. So I was thinking, putting doors in here. But... The sound of them going in and out of the doors would probably be unbearable. So instead, I'll probably probably just block it off. Where if I get it to go across? I wonder if I put it there, if that's just too low for them to walk through. Nope. I put another one. Oh. Uh-huh. <laughs> that's kind of cool. Uh, that's awesome. <laughs> oh, the little things. And I'm out. Strips. Oh, I still had a whole freaking stack. I still had a whole stack of strips. Why didn't anybody tell me? Alright, someone just got hurt. Why are they getting hurt? I just heard... I just heard a guy get hurt. How are they getting hurt? Hey, Mr. Guy with an arrow. Yeah, you suck. You suck. That's my wand. Fuck. 
fry, bitch. Fry. That was complete and total overkill. I don't care. I hope I'm not hitting the villagers. <laughs> Whoop. Get rid of this crap. Alright, well. This place has got a little bit of tweaking to do. Uh, let's see. Here, let's see. Let's grab one. Let's see what he does. Hey, buddy. We're gonna go for a ride. Oh, come on. Here we go. We're gonna go for a ride. What do you think? Hmm? Uh -huh. Do you approve? Yeah, we're definitely gonna need a roof. What do you think? You like it? Dude, you're almost dead. How are you almost dead? Who the hell was killing you? Is it me? Did I do it? Well, we might just kill you anyways. That's good. It's good to know that they can't move around. I need to keep them away from the freaking door. I'm going to keep messing with this place. I'm going to get some villagers in here for my auto spawner. And uh, see what happens. See what kind of trades I got going with those guys too. Maybe I'll make a trading post. Does this have a trading post? I recently saw somebody do trading posts. Trading posts. Trading. Trading posts. Nice. All right. Black oh emerald. That's gonna be expensive. Well, anyways, thanks for watching. Uh I'm gonna call this an episode. I'll see you next time. Later, y'all.